Welcome back everyone to another Bloodline video. It is your boy Steve back at it with another new release video. We're going to be talking about products coming out between now and the end of January. No Ryan today. We had to change our plans a little bit because Top's Finest Baseball did not come out today at the day of recording. Um, when it was supposed to, we were going to rip some Top's Finest. That was going to be today's video, but change of plans because Top's Finest got pushed back, but only by one day as far as we know for now, as of Wednesday. But before we get in any further new releases, we're going to talk, or I want to remind everybody that we do have a giveaway going on. We are giving away one hanger box of 21 Prism Football. Uh, that giveaway ends Saturday, and we'll announce the winner this Sunday, which is the 22nd, 20, um, which is the 22nd. So, you're going to want to get on that giveaway as soon as possible. All you got to do is be a subscriber, like the video that's going to be tagged up top. That is our Skybox Metal Hockey video. That's where we announce the giveaway. That's where you got to make the like and comment who your favorite NHL team is. You have until Saturday, midnight Central Standard Time, and we will announce the winner at noon on Sunday the 22nd. So now that that's out of the way, let's go ahead and get into some products that we are going to be looking at or looking forward to in throughout the rest of January. Now, I did mention Top's Finest Baseball. That got pushed back, but only till tomorrow. So it will come out January 2nd, at least as of right now. It could get pushed back again. I don't see why Top's would push it back two days. Um, I Maybe it gets pushed again. Hopefully not, though. But there's a couple good releases coming out this Friday. You have Bowman Chrome Sapphire Baseball coming out. That is usually a Top's Online exclusive, so you're going to want to be checking Top's site Usually in the morning, I think it's between 9 or 10 uh, Central Standard Time. So 11, we'll say uh, 11 Eastern Time, which is 8 a.m. Pacific Time. So s somewhere right around there, I believe, is when Tops usually throw those on the website. I'm going to try to get my hands on a Bowman Chrome. I like Bowman Chrome. Um, so we might try to get our hands on the product. I don't see the checklist is on cardboard connection But for those of you who don't know these are kind of what the chrome cards look like base is going to be a blue looking chrome card uh, They have teals. They have reds. They have autos. We've opened this. I think it was Bowman Sapphire not Bowman chrome last year where we pulled a Khalil Watson base first bowman and some other cool cards here's the checklist not going to go into it too much i was hoping some more images but still supposed to be coming out in january these usually run 300 dollars a box i don't think I'm trying to think 250 300 dollars i'm i that's an, a guesstimate based off what i might have paid last year uh looks like that's something different it looks like i think that's different but that is coming out. That is going to be a Tops Online exclusive. So you're going to be wanting to, again, checking top site for that. Um, let me see if Cardboard Connection mentioned that. Uh, featuring 32 cards, including two limited parallels. 2001 box was $199. I can, I can expect uh, this year's version will be probably somewhere between two and 250, maybe even 300. Depends. Tops have raised their prices from last year, but not crazy. It's going to be an online exclusive. So you're going to want to check out tops.com. Now the next product that we did preview last time in our new releases video, and we're going to go over it again because I know the checklist is available. So tops finest baseball 2022. Again, a fun set. I love to rip. I usually rip it every year the last couple of years. Um, I believe here's the checklist you're going to be looking for you can pull wanders you can brew Hans, Josh Lowe uh, and Jeremy Pena that's another one I'll be chasing I'm a fan of his you can pull O'Neill Cruz um, O'Neill Cruz Julio Rodriguez Brian De La Cruz he's a good good player Miami's starting to look better and better um, there's another one I believe Where's Kansas City? Kansas City. Bobby Witt Jr. There's the other person I was looking for. So that's kind of why I wanted to go over this again when it got pushed back. The checklist was not available the last time we did a new releases video. So the checklist is available. So it's a de facto uh, uh, preview of Top's Finest to come out, which Ryan and I will be getting our hands on. So you have Royce Lewis. You have Spencer Torkelson. I see him here. Helio Romez. Um, Helio Romez. Bobby Witt Jr. Julio Rodriguez. Jeremy Pena. 
a lot of those big guys, Spencer Torkelson and Wander Franco rookie cards. So I imagine this will be a fun product to open in and chase some of those guys who were top prospects in the last few years and um, have potentially a bright future ahead of them. So that's that's part of the reason why I'm getting it. I've checked pre-orders on this too on Steel City and um, David Adams. And they're pre-sailing right at $250. I imagine card shops are going to be right around $250, $275. So keep that in mind when you, or if you're considering purchasing this, they're going to run you between $250 and $300. Now also coming out is Futura Unique World Soccer. I don't know what this product is. Um, last year production, it looks like a very limited type of product. It looks like high-end product. It doesn't look like Panini or anything like that. So I imagine this will be no joke. So if you know, if you've opened any of this in the past, go ahead and let us know in the comments what you thought. It looks like last year's product is running about a thousand dollars on eBay. Uh, so that looks like a, a very high-end soccer product. Now you also do have on the twenty-second, which I believe is next Wednesday. Uh, Bowman Draft Sapphire. And now that I think about it, I said I was looking at Bowman Chrome. I think it's actually uh, Bowman Draft Sapphire that I'm going to be looking at. We do have the checklist. Again, it's going to have the different colored parallels and usually the cracked ice or the sapphire looking. Blue is going to be the base. You have teal, orange, red. Or actually, uh, does it show the parallel breakdown here? Because that would be fantastic if it did. It does not. But we can look at last year's and it should give us a better breakdown. So last year's consisted of yellow numbered to 99, green, orange, aqua, gold to 15, purple to 10, red to 5, and pata parashkata, I think that's how that's pronounced, numbered to 1. So those are the different colored parallels you can get. I really like opening chrome because you, or uh, sapphire because you usually get an auto. You usually get at least one or two numbered parallels. The auto could be a numbered parallel. So really fun product to look. I think the chase in here is Arias from the uh, Yankees. It'd be help if I could spell. Let's just do Yankees. Another one, Anthony Volpe's in here. I don't think it's his first Bowman. Roddick Arias, that, this gentleman right here. I believe he's the number one. Uh, Ellie De La Cruz, I don't think that's his first Bowman, but another good one to possibly pull. Rangers fans, I believe you are going to be wanting to look at Rocker. Kumar Rocker of the Texas Rangers, our number one draft pick this year. He does have his first Bowman here. And uh, so, yeah, this is another cool product. One I will probably probably try to get my hands on either one of these sapphire products i don't think i'll go after both now on the same day wednesday oh come on computer stop messing around with me panini illusions football is also coming out i like illusions i don't love illusions uh it's a very cool and uh interesting design i just i don't, I don't love it too much i don't hate it i don't love it i usually usually ryan and i get a little bit of retail um with us trying to rip more hobby boxes this year, we might go after a hobby box. Hobby boxes have three autos, two mems, five numbered trophy collection cards, 10 acetate or micro etch cards in a hobby box. So they consist of five cards per pack, 10 packs per box, 50 cards per box, and six boxes per case. Really cool one. Again, this is going to be this year. So you're going to be looking for uh, probably Brock Purdy and and Malik Willis and, and Kenny Pickett and some of those guys from last year's draft. Real cool product. I'm not sure what this is going for. eBay or the uh, Cardboard Connection has it right around 400. I could see that being the case. Um, let's, uh, let's do a quick Google search. 2022 Illusions Football. Let's see what... Steel City Collectibles. Steel City has it pre-ordering at $400. So that's pretty spot on. Pretty spot on. Sometimes this number can be a little off, but it is working well today. So uh, I don't know if there's an H2 version of this. The retail version is pretty cool. So if you're interested in Illusions, Illusions Football will be should be coming out. I'm going to say should because they tend to push stuff back. 11-25, which is next Wednesday. And then probably the biggest product 
maybe. I think that's questionable with Upper Deck's Artifact Hockey coming out. But Mosaic Basketball 21-22 is coming out. This is going to run you a pretty penny. Boxes, oh, that's for uh, first off the line. But looks like about $450 for a Mosaic Hobby Box. Going to be looking for some exclusive reds and blues and purples and 75th anniversaries. Now, I believe, who's the rookie in here? I believe this is the Cades, the checklist, uh, 22, 23. I believe this is still the Cades. One autograph per box. So, sorry, 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 sorry. My computer's having a fit. So, still expected next Wednesday. Pull some really cool stuff out of it. I'm trying to see who the rookies are don't remember here this will help me I'm gonna look at last year's 21 22 that should be Lamello. why am I adding a bookmark that's not what I'm trying to do I'm trying to control F uh, Edwards so yeah this is gonna be the current draft or the the last year's draft class not the most recent NBA so this is gonna be the Cade Jalen's uh, Jalen Green Jalen Suggs this is gonna be the Scotty Barnes box this might be another one ryan and i go after i do like this draft class they have some pretty solid talent in it uh even evan mobley so this is another one ryan and i might consider this is some good products coming out towards the end of january mosaic another one of those i hit back a little premature so wanted to look at the designs but we've seen mosaic uh always a cool set always a fun set if you could pull some of these stained glasses or in this case it's called translucent super rare but i would love to pull a stained glass i've never pulled one and i know ryan would too so that's another one we might uh as we get closer to release and the checklist comes out we might do a checklist video so you might want to stay tuned for that and then the last product that we will discuss that is slated for november because i don't know what this is and i don't know what garbage pail kids are but last product coming out in January, also next Wednesday, is Artifacts Hockey. I don't know too much about this. I know I like the design. I've seen them at card shows. I've seen a couple boxes ripped. You have a good parallel breakdown. You can get turquoise out of Artifacts Blasters. There is a retail version of this. Uh, ruby, copper, royal blue, emerald. You can get them all the way down from $4.99 to number to five. What year is this? So this is the 22-23 last year. So this is not Robinson's year. So you got Kent Johnson as a rookie. Some cool cards. Uh, for you, those of you who follow hockey a little more, let me know who is going to be the chase. Uh, who's going to be the chases coming out of here? I know you could. You always want to chase the the vets, the Connor McDavid's, the Alex Ovechkin's as he continues to get closer and closer to Gretzky. Gretzky's all time goal list or uh, all time goal record. But let us know who's. Um, out of these rookies, who's the rookies to go after? Kent Johnson, who was featured above? Um, or is it going to be somebody else? Honestly, I do not know. So let us know down in the comments who is that Chase rookie out of this. Also let us know who or which of these sets are you most interested in. Is it Topps Finest Baseball? Is it going to be the Bowman Chrome Sapphire, which is also a Topps Online exclusive? I don't know if I mentioned that. Or are you going to be looking at Upper Desk Hockey or... What I expect most of you to say is going to be Mosaic Basketball, especially since that retail product will probably be hitting the shelves. Let's see. If Hobby is the 25th, I would say probably within three weeks of Hobby coming out, maybe a month. So maybe mid to late February is when we'll start seeing some retail, retail Mosaic Basketball. Um, but I haven't seen too much movement on Target since, since uh, the holidays. I know Mosaic Football started dropping recently. But that's about that's all I, I can think of. But that is going to do it for this video. I hope everyone enjoyed this or found this product or this video informative. If you are looking to rip some hockey or waiting for some of these um, retail products to come out like Artifacts or Mosaic, you're probably going to start seeing some of those. I'm not sure how Upper Deck is with, with hockey uh, and timing their retail versus hobby. If they come out at the same time or if they're like Panini and a little delayed. I haven't paid too much attention, so I might... I might with artifacts, but let us know which of these sets you're excited to get your hands on. I think for, for me, it's going to be Top's Finest, which you should, 
if all goes well, be seeing in your next in our next video. We're going to have a Saturday video with Top's Finest, so you're going to want to stay tuned for that. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell, and that'll do it for this video. Until next time, y'all, I'll catch you.